For the Americans the American Revolutionary War was essentially two parallel wars, while the war in the East was a struggle against British rule, the war in the West was an Indian war. The newly proclaimed United States competed with the British for control of the territory of Native American nations east of the Mississippi River. Some Native Americans who joined the struggle sided with the British, as they hoped to win the opportunity to reduce settlement and expansion onto their land. The Revolutionary War was the most extensive and destructive Indian war in United States history. Some Native communities were divided over which side to support in the war. For the Iroquois Confederacy, based in New York and Pennsylvania, the American Revolution resulted in civil war, the Six Nations split, with the Oneida and Tuscarora siding with the rebels, and Mohawk, Seneca, Cayuga, and Onondaga fighting with and for the British. While the Iroquois tried to avoid fighting directly against one another, the revolution eventually forced intra-Iroquois combat. Both sides lost territory following the United States establishing its independence. The Crown aided the landless Iroquois by rewarding them with a reservation at Grand River in Ontario and some other lands. In the southeast, the Cherokee split into a neutral, or pro-patriot, faction and a pro-British faction, whom the Americans referred to as the Chickamauga Cherokee, they were led by Dragging Canoe. Many other tribes were similarly divided. Both immigrant and native non-combatants suffered greatly during the war, and villages and food supplies were frequently destroyed during military expeditions. The largest of these expeditions was the Sullivan Expedition of 1779, which raised more than 40 Iroquois villages. When the British made peace with the Americans in the Treaty of Paris, 1783, they ceded a vast amount of Native American territory, without the consent of the indigenous peoples, to the United States. The United States treated the Native Americans who had fought with the British as enemy allies, a conquered people who had lost their land. The federal government of the United States was eager to expand, and the national government did so by purchasing Native American land in treaties and through warfare. 